Hey folks, it's Andrew from Money Mental UK here, the YouTube channel dedicated to money and mental health. Today it's a bit of an update on progress with my storage unit. I've come down here, as we know it's now full of stuff from um, my shipping container. Um, so it's time to uh, organise the stock. Um, I've still got a load of stuff at home that needs to come down as well. So it's a Saturday afternoon, um, it's quarter to five already. I've all I've done today is pick up some more stock from the charity shop, despite being on a sourcing ban. Uh, I've got a new dehumidifier. I say new, it's a bit of a vintage model, but it's an industrial one. Um, uh, designed to be constantly on. So hopefully um, that'll be a good good thing to have. I've got it here in the office at the minute, um, because I think um, this is the, the room that needs to be sort of dry and free of damp, because I'm obviously going to have my computer and me lighting and everything in here so that's going on in here um, I've also ordered a heater again to go in here um, so the office will all be nice and warm and dry um, for downstairs as I say everything is going in boxes and then on some shelving um, I will be putting the shelving together today um, so I'll show you my progress on doing that and then um, I've got a sell some stuff so I can buy some more boxes basically to uh, to put stock in so um, yeah I'll uh, I'll show you me putting the uh, the shelving together anyway and um, we'll see how much progress we get I've got six sets to make I've got a I've got a mallet um, which is like a cheap hammer as far as I can understand um, so I'm gonna go and put those together and we'll see how I get on see you in a bit folks and here's a top tip folks when you have bought some shelves that are in boxes like so get a seal um, get a knife or some scissors yeah bring it with you I'm gonna head over to the range grab some scissors from there I need some more for the unit anyway grab a couple of other things from there that I need for, for the unit and then I'm gonna come back and try and do these um, these shelves so yeah in a bit folks okay so I spent 40 pounds in the range in the end but I got some stuff I needed, like tools and stuff, and uh, a wok for cooking with Andrew, so that's exciting. A non-stick wok, a big one, it was only $7.99, so I couldn't leave it behind. And yeah, a toolbox as well to keep all my stuff in, because I keep losing it. So yeah, see you back at the uh, back at the unit. So, the shelves are coming along. One set is underway. Um, yeah, I'm hoping I'll get at least a couple done tonight, maybe more, before I head off. Okay, so the first set of shelves is built. I've realised that these shelves aren't as deep as the uh, ones I've got in my garage. Um, so the next load I order are going to have to be uh, deeper shelves, but lesson learned. Also, the instructions that came with these things were appalling. Like, I couldn't follow them at all, but fortunately I've still got the instructions from when I built my other shelves in the garage, so thank goodness for that, because they're a lot easier to follow. Right, I'm going to crack on with the next set of shelving. And there we have the second unit in place. Um, I'm, going to do, I'm going to do one more before I go home. I've got room to fit just one more in there. So I'm going to get three on, and then I can start doing the back walls. Um, tomorrow so yeah could I do one more wish me luck and that's it folks three shells are up so I've got three more down there to put up and I've got three sets of metal shells over there um, so I'll try and get all those done tomorrow but yeah for now I'm gonna go home I'm gonna have a shower bath or whatever I'm gonna have something to eat and I'm gonna have some chill out time Thanks for watching folks, I'll see you on the next update video. Bye for now.